Hi guys, my name is Zolpreem and in today's video I'll be talking about a certain film I'd really like to see come out and that is Red Hood. Now I'll just give you giving you my ideas, uh possible uh things that could happen in the film and when maybe the film could come out. Now I really do want a Red Hood film and that's just my opinion and if you do not know who uh the Red Hood is basically he is a former robin and it's the jason todd one jason todd robin and basically he was killed by the joker and he got resurrected i forgot how i'm sorry and he then he became an anti-hero a persona of an anti-hero murder uh, criminals and like badly like really hurt them and he kind of had a vendetta on Batman. I don't know if he killed criminals because Batman did. I don't really know. But he was very angry because Batman didn't avenge him and get back on Joker or even kill him. Because I think yeah, Batman and Joker have a really good, like, they have a, kind of like a friendship relationship. Like, they don't want to kill each other. Kind of like that. But anyway, and I really want to see a Red Hood film. Now, I've seen this really good fan made trailer. And it's amazing, like a really, really. I mean, if you go on YouTube, I'll put the link in the description to the fan made trailer. It's a really good one, to a crisp. They've made it really well. And basically, if you didn't see, if you didn't watch Batman vs Superman, there's a little Easter egg to uh, what happened to Jason Todd, and it's kind of like a statue of of Jason Todd as Robin, not Red Hood. And uh, Joker's got graffiti, and it's saying ha ha ha. Uh, it says ha ha jokes on you batman and basically i think joker killed uh, jason because just to get back at batman now jason Todd was really angry after he came back i forgot okay i'm sorry after he came back he was really angry batman didn't get revenge or look uh try to look for whoever killed him so uh because jason jason todd said he'd do he'd do it for batman because jason todd in the comics really loved batman like he was just like a role model like a father to him and he kind of let him down in a sense, and I do agree with uh, Jason Todd's, uh, uh, what could you call it, Jason Todd's vendetta, his, his motive for trying to get back at Batman, and Jason Todd was very angry, and uh, there's, an, there's actual like different ways he came back in the, in the comics, some, some say, uh, what was it, spirits? Some say super, super boy bring him back, and some say, I forgot, I forgot the other one. But yeah, the main one I forgot. The main one was, but I really do want to see um, a Jason Todd film. Like you could, you could actually make a a Red Hood film. It could be like Batman Red Hood or just Red Hood because that Easter egg of the Jason Todd one in uh, Batman vs Superman that could lead on uh, to like at the start of the wait. You could like do flashbacks of how he died and who he was before he became Red Hood and who. Like what was it is a what was he about and all that kind of stuff, and they can actually build off that like that statue. They can build off that uh, and make a separate film about it. I don't think they're gonna do that. Like I don't think they're intentionally put that that um, statue in just to tease uh, a Red Hood film. But it really would be cool if it could happen. Like maybe twenty eighteen, twenty nineteen. Absolutely sick because. Jason Todd could actually match Batman. Like he's the only like the one, one of the only people that can match Batman's strengths and and fighting other than Deathstroke as well. And uh, he's a very good character. He's got a good motive and all that stuff. And it's it's great. Now in the um film, I'd really like to see Jason Todd. I really want to see flashbacks before we see him. Why he did it? Like I want to see flashbacks. So if no one of like some like maybe new fans of batman never heard of uh the red hood you you could just watch that film and you just know everything about him why he did this and why he did that and that would be really sick i really want, i think the flashbacks would make the film great not really the vendetta the flashbacks him uh getting killed by joker and all that stuff and if they did this i think it'd have just to be a batman film not other characters like maybe joker could make a, a little appearance uh Batman would be a pretty big character, and so would Jay, uh, Red Hood, you know, Red Hood or Jason Todd. Now, 
what I think is going to happen. I think they will eventually, in my opinion, make a Red Hood film. 2019, 18 kind of thing. And I think they'll make it and kind of, how to explain, they'll shot emphasis on revenge, I'd say. Like, how someone get revenge. But, you know, hopefully we can see, like, Batman's realise how, how bad he was to not, like, go after the villain that killed him, you know. And I hope Jason Todd can make him do that. But I don't think at the end of the film, if it ever happens, that um, Jason Todd will die. If he does, that would be very annoying. I think he'll either get locked up or Jason Todd will end his vendetta. Maybe Batman will explain. We'll just be like, oh, I did a really bad thing. I'm sorry. And start, like, just showing his emotions, you know. Because usually uh, he's kind of, he's not really, he doesn't like to show his emotions, you know. That's that's kind of his persona, the the Dark Knight. You know, what I mean? but show his um, emotions. But I really think Jason Todd can make him do that because um, Jason Todd, when he came back to life, he got all the equipment. He had the the high tech mask. He had the, the the armor. He had the guns. He had all of that. He looked suited and booted, but especially in the Batman Arkham Knight game, he looked so suited and booted. He looked absolutely amazing. Like. They did a really good job on that. And if they really make a film, uh, I'd really like to see the, um, like, his, uh, you know, equipment and all that stuff. Like, how he's geared up to just take on Batman, you know. I think they will fight, but I don't think Batman will want, will want to fight him. I think he'll be like, no, I don't want to do this, blah, blah, blah. And, uh, I don't know, maybe Joker could, could appear. And Jason Todd will try, well, maybe, maybe he's not even getting angry at Joker, maybe he's just really angry at Batman, you know, but I really do want to see that scene where Jason Todd's so scared of Joker, and Joker's like, oh, just torturing and hurting him, and he's just terrified, and then you just see another flat, and then you just see him now, it's tough, not scared of anything, angry, like, the transformation of uh, yeah, innocent Jason Todd into a fierce, brutal Red Hood, that I, I really want to see that transformation. That'd be absolutely sick. Either it's a standalone, just nothing to do with Batman, just a good Red Hood, or Batman Red Hood, or something like that. I'd be absolutely sick. But yeah, that's my opinion on what uh, I'd like to see when it comes to um, a Red Hood film. And if it ever happened, it'd be absolutely um, sick. I hope you liked this video, talking about the Red Hood, a possible Red Hood film. If you make sure to hit that like button, it really would be appreciated. I'm Zolpreme. You guys have been the best. Peace out.